All right, the band RDL, Romanian deadlift. The difference between the Romanian deadlift and the, basically the American deadlift, the regular deadlift, is what's happening at the knees, okay? The knees are bent, but not bending in the RDL, okay? So hip hinge with resistance. In this case, we're using the resistance band. So we really want to pay attention to the hinging pattern because the band is going up and down, but the exercise is back and forth. So don't think about the vertical of the band, think about the horizontal of the hip. Now, as far as the setup, you may have noticed that I actually had my hands in the band like this and then looped my fingers like that. It's a much, much easier grip, especially as you get to the heavier loads. Now, it does make the band a little bit heavier because you just shorten the band at both ends, so it's going to be a little bit more resistance. However, when I'm gripping this way, my fingers are really going to be a weak link as I get to the heavier loads. Okay, so just keep that in mind with your setup. Now, as I get in, I'm just going to step on the double band. Now, generally your posture is going to be pretty crappy at this point. That's fine. Get yourself set so I can get my hands in. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop my butt, lift my chest up. I haven't lifted the weight yet. Now, I'm going to deadlift it up. So, from the side, let's go back down. So, I'm down here, getting myself set. Posture on the pickup. From there, I go into my Romanian deadlift. Okay? One other thing I want to point out is what's happening with the chin or the neck. What we don't want to do is as we go down, we look forward. See how the neck is that crank as I'm looking forward? Keep the chin tucked. So my head is in alignment in this position. Should stay in that alignment the entire time. Don't, hey, my eyes are forward, so I keep my eyes forward. Nope. Imagine you got a grapefruit underneath your chin and you try to tuck it and don't lose it on the way down. It's a pretty good um, way to think about it. But the idea is my cervical spine, thoracic spine are in alignment here. They should be in alignment the whole way through. That's going to protect the neck. All right, that's the Romanian deadlift.